like a Vespa shop. Good morning, we are so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you enjoyed this video, make sure you come back tomorrow and every day after. I'm on my run, it's supposed to be a 6 a.m. run. Turned into a 7 a.m. because I haven't slept, but I honestly, because of the nature and how this is, this works, I don't feel bad because that just means that I get one less, one less hour between my 6 slash 7 a.m. run and my 10 a.m. run. I'm not going to push that back, so it just means that it'll be close to 8 when I get done with this and only have two hours then until my 10, but my body is stiff. But fingers crossed it just loosens up because today we are finishing out the 4x4x48. Four by four by All right, it's a little bit after 10 gonna go out and run towards downtown Orlando for the last time. Uh, this will be miles, gosh, 32 to 36. Um, I'm very sore. My muscles, I think, I think it's from a um, combination of lack of sleep and mostly, oh, excuse me, mostly those Peloton workouts, especially yesterday's was all about like upper body strength and core and something I need to work on um but this is exciting because it's like for me it's like the last run I th I'm hoping I'll have to push my energy because it's the last run towards downtown and then the next one I'll do a typical route that I do throughout Winter Park as my last last run but it's a little past 10 didn't have that I had cut my rest short because I ran the first one in the morning later but I feel good and ready I hydrated, I ate. Let's do it. Peter, there's a delivery. That's Eve's defense bark when someone's at the door. I just woke up. I am going to get laced up and changed for the final four mi miles. I woke up to... to um, I woke up to craziness. Oh my word look at this it's a mother's day an early mother's day feast from christina and i'm sure, sure the kids and grant and my mom but the perplexing part is i'm supposed to go run like this moment <laughs> but i have Heal to eat up. this fresh so i'm gonna delay my last run by like five minutes yeah i devoured my food really quickly guys four I might have, I've like, I am known for having like food in the corner of my mouth. She's a four year old little girl. <laughs> um, for 20, no, maybe like five seconds today, I thought that Peter could have stopped breathing <laughs> while he was sleeping. I went in to check him. I was dead. His eyes were half open. Both of us sleep with our eyes open. Um, but it was like more than usual and his mouth was wide open and it was like back and he wasn't like breathing very deeply we're very still and i was very concerned i woke up to sarah over me like i was like peter <laughs> peter typically i'm very like honey gotta get up Just wake up are you alive <laughs> i was like peter are you alive so i'm gonna go finish this uh now that i've devoured sorry it. my arm is tired because i carried eve for like a block now that i just devoured a bunch of that market and delicious market on south I'm gonna go run this last four miles. <laughs> um, As a true Brookhart way. I am done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. And I rested for like, what, 20 minutes maybe? I took a shower, rolled my legs. Um, but we're gonna go run some errands. Gotta go to the P.O. Box, gotta stop by a grocery store or two, I think. Um, Sarah's gonna stay in the car, but she's gonna join me in the drive. Alright, so. We were about to leave the P.O. Box. Um, we had one of our friends order something off our registry. What is it, Baby, baby List? Baby list. Baby list Just like cage. I keep calling it the cage. <laughs> and you'll understand why when we get it, but we didn't receive it yet. And then my sister bought us this awesome diaper bag, Disney mm -hmm. diaper bag. And I was hopeful that they would be there. At least the diaper bag, because that was 
purchased through Amazon, and they're usually spot on with their shipping. Um, but things are saying, slow. Yeah, things are slower right now, yeah. so that's okay. Yeah, we just had two things that we thought would be there. But we're gonna go get milkshakes, I think. Well, we're gonna, are we getting food there too? Uh, well, we kind of just ate it too, but like you've been burning through your <laughs> calories and I'm always hungry. I just figure like, so we're kind of have to go out of our way. It's closer to Winter Garden and we're going to get really close to Disney property, like the backside of Magic Kingdom. And I'm really excited to help we see part of it because I miss it and I love it so much. Mm -hmm. um, but it's buy one get one milk hits because it just reopened. Yeah. And I think we should, don't they have pizza? Didn't they have delicious flatbread pizza? Yeah. I think we should get other food too. If we're gonna drive there, it's like an additional well, twenty minutes I, I for you us. I thought wanted a sushi burrito. I'm okay with this instead. Maybe we'll figure it on the way. <laughs> okay. Remember when we came here many moons ago? We've only been here once, right? Yeah. We came right as it opened. Yeah. It feels so weird to be back in a restaurant. I think we're gonna eat in the car out, oh, but I love that sign. I love the decor of this place. I wish we came more, but it's just a little bit of a drive for us. This sign is 100% our life mentality. Life well fed. And I love the wall with the fake grass. I love it. There's my burger. Shake. Sarah's pizza reveal. Oh. <laughs> Excited? I'm, I'm having a piece. This is, it's a truffle burger and it's absolutely divinity. golfing though. We did not expect to come to Disney property today, but here we are. Christina, look at these turkeys. Look at these turkeys. Oh my goodness. We gotta let them cross the road. Nature has returned. <laughs> the car behind us is pulling their camera out too. A little bit of Tower of Terror action. <laughs> the Skyliner. Wow. The oh, boardwalk. I saw I, I, call, I saw Future World. I saw the DVC Lounge. And I can see Paris. I can see the Earhart's. They're at the boardwalk where they live. That's, that's their permanent residence. And our last drive by before we head on home is Little Miss Disney Springs. Disney Springs, I miss you, Sugaboo. Coming for you May 20th. Are we coming for them? Maybe. Even if we don't go in anything or go by anybody. We might stroll. We just we haven't made a plan yet, but it was announced that Disney Springs is opening back up May twentieth because of how many But it's only gonna be third party. Yeah, how many um third party locations are in there. Gotta wear a mask. What up Mickey Mouse, what up Disney World sign? We'll see you soon, I love you so much. Okay, I'm supposed to get chamomile tea because it's supposed to help me sleep. Because uh Whatever uh, the other the supplement I'm taking is like hit or miss. I was gonna get camel tea, but this one's called Nighty Night Extra. So I think I'm gonna try that. It's a Valorant herbal tea. Um, I think I might have to get this for tomorrow. I have to call Sarah. She might want that. We might want this. I want that for sure. We're doing bre a big breakfast tomorrow for Mother's Day. We're still watching Guardians of the Galaxy 2, right? <laughs> you trying to think of? Two in another language and couldn't. How'd you know? 
because I know how your I brain can't works. speak my first language well. Uh, Wait, I'm supposed language. to do a taste test for Christina. I'm doing it. Wait. <laughs> Don't <laughs> smell your kombucha right when you open it, kid. <laughs> Sorry about the shakiness of this shot. Okay. This is the 25th anniversary edition of Kombucha JTS. Take her life! <laughs> Gee. <laughs> it's good. Tastes like kombucha. Alright, so that was like the longest I think in two weeks that we left Eve alone. So she was so cute and happy to see us when we got home. But look at our little whole food spread Mother's Day celebration. We're gonna do, I'm gonna make breakfast for Sarah in the morning, do a little breakfast in bed, I think, but we got some hazelnut filled powdered sugar donuts. These uh, chocolate coconut milk moochie is for tonight, I think. Hash browns, dark chocolate chip waffles, pumpkin spices, this is for me, you know it. Mushrooms, we're gonna put the mushrooms on the waffles, just kidding, don't know why we have those. I think Sarah wanted to make a gravy for something. My nighty night extra. Sarah's little sister Christine is an influencer and convinced her to try these. This new kombucha and then we got Sarah a spritzer the San Pellegrino Momenti pomegranate and black currant got this sack of lemons don't know why Sarah asked me to get them but I got them and then I got me a bottle of red to celebrate the end of the challenge you found us you found a cat well Eve the cat's gone cat doesn't want to play with you Everson you don't get any ideas of like freedom, like the outside <laughs> world. <laughs> like. You okay? Come on. That looked like you, kind of, huh? Yeah. It was an all black cat looking like Hocus Pocus. We are two tired pails. I meant to take my contacts out. Oh man. Anyways, we are. Going to watch Guardians of the Galaxy 2 because we're still doing the Marvel movie marathon. And Peter's pumped because he doesn't have to go out and run in four hours. Um, we're really full from humble. We really enjoyed our meal. The burger was the best. The pizza was good. We wish that there was less um, stuff on it and more marinara sauce and like a little bit more like structure, like crispiness to the actual dough but overall really good oh my the burger was the best why was the burger the best it was scratch made. yeah it was um uh, it wasn't like a a brand burger it was a house made burger and it had mushrooms on it with the it truffle like, it was made of, like you could tell it was made of yeah it was really good it was like almost like fall party, but it was really really good um and our, our, my chocolate shake was like you could not even tell it was plant-based. Peter's coffee shake you could, but it was really good coffee flavor. So we're home. Eve's pumped. And we're going to watch this movie. And hopefully Galaxy we don't fall asleep. I won't. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It is before midnight on a Saturday, and we are going to bed. Today is... May 9th. Today's message is by Wayne Dyer. Conflict cannot survive without your participation. Ooh. Don't let the haters hate. That's basically what that means. If the haters hate, you're letting the haters hate. Don't let the haters hate. Did you like Guardians of the Galaxy 2? Volume it kind of had me like, was pulling my heartstrings the whole yeah. time. I think I liked the first one because it's more fun. But this one, like, solidifies their characters. Yeah. Yeah, it was good. And there's going to be a third one? Yes. Because whenever I type in Guardians of the Galaxy to look at IMDb, three always pops up. It's before midnight. We're going to sleep in tomorrow. <sighs> Peter doesn't have to work out in two hours. <laughs> <laughs> it's, now, it's now past two of my four-hour windows where I haven't gone running. Yes. Victory is it. mine. I did it. I did Victory. it. Victory. To be honest, and I, I confess this to Carolyn Earhart, that um, I'm more worn out from the, the cardio like core Peloton classes mm -hmm. than the running. Like my arms are sore, my core is sore. Like I can't lift my like it's my arm is killing me holding this camera up. Can't pull my arms down. 
<laughs> but we're going to sleep in good. It's good to be home. And then we're going to celebrate Mother's Day. Because this chick is a mother. First a fish. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>